Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel, and today we're back with more cash game content, playing 1-2 with a $200 bind. Alright, so limp, raise, jack, 10 suit, a big line, 3 bets, we'll flatten position. Uh, flop a decent draw here, so we got the open under with the backdoor diamonds. Go ahead and bets, call here, turn the straight beautiful. Uh, I'm trying to think if we ever have jams here. It checks me, so we're just going to be betting, but... So go for half pot. All spades coming on the river. Makes it harder to get paid. We also lose a spades. I think a straight still jams, though. Uh, what is this? 117 effective 172. So I think we still jam the straight, but obviously not like the perfect river card. And magic calls top two. There we go. Jack 10's good. All right. So this one is open. We three bet big blind, get called, bet the flop, bet the turn. Snap calls nine rivers. We have ace king with the king of diamonds. It's gonna be a river jam here at the top ace. Going for it all here. Snap calls king ten. Let's go. Nice. Come on, believe we're at the king high. Take it down. Jump over here with ace jack. We open button, small one, three bets. We call pretty deep here, so about 200 bigs effective. Uh, goes for small bet call. Turn five. And then small on the turn. And small just gonna call here and then diamond to river. So if we get checked to go for value, if they bet again a bigger size, I th even at small size, we probably just call. Um, it's hard to get worse to call raises. Um, if he checks though, I do like going for value. Would be pretty sick if he jammed here. I think this combo would have to be a call if he jams. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, pretty sick. Pretty sick spots potentially be bluffing, but I think ace jack with the jack of diamonds probably wants to call. I don't think he's going to want to rip like ace king ace queen now unless it's the diamonds which i guess he could have um obviously this is a pretty deep pot oh man i haven't played this player much but i'm pretty sure they're a reg that plays higher stakes cash too if i had if it was ace jack with no diamond i would fold this i'm trying to think with the diamond what i want to do um i think we probably just have to call it with the diamond but shows 10 9 for the bluff with the boat blocker and we're good yeah here with queens open three bet cold call we put in the four bet player calls so we've got the over pair with the spade pretty connected board here not folding has 10 nine so we got 61 percent oh turns it straight oh get it in the good there just can't hold all right defend six five suit here flop the flush all right so go for a small check raise here six on the turn Red bet turn here. I'm trying to think if I jam river if they call or not on bricks. I'm trying to get worse to call, or do I try to give them a chance to bluff with like the ace of clubs? That's the problem with like this week of a flush. I think we still just jam against their stat line. It's only like 100 hands, but 40, 27, and 9. I could probably just jam any flush if they just call here. It does feel pretty gross actually if they jam turn. Like I would still call, but just don't beat much. These are spots that maybe be good for me to study a bit more. Um, actually, SPR is deeper. I'm going to change mine and just check here and check Hall River. Uh, against this player's stat line, I don't know, chat. This is this is kind of a nit roll, maybe, but... Oh, they have to be really going nuts. I'm definitely going to want to review this one after. I mean, the problem is if I'm going to check Fold River, I maybe should just check the turn. Oh, so, like, what value? I'm not going to bet... I mean, I guess this is actually the bottom of my value range that check raises their turn. All right. This is where I'm going to call up the pot and then fold against 1.6x Jam River. All right, so ace five suited. It can go either way between flat and four bet. I'm going to use the four bet this time. About 150 bigs effective. And flats. All right, so I'm going to go for quarter pot. We flop the flush draw. Pretty wet board here. Third jams. All right set so we still only got 26 percent old nice all right so we get it with only 26 percent there do get lucky after he flops a set massive pause like a 600 hundred dollar pot raise these two suited couple calls flop these high flush draw turn the nuts nice go for turn bet Ooh, get raised by t clark all right so i don't think we want to have raises here i don't think he's gonna have two pairs or sets so i actually feel like we're in a really good spot here flush versus flush 
River's probably fine. Like I said, he's basically repping a flush or as a draw. So I don't think he's going to race two pair on the spades coming in multi-way. So over bets, and then we just put it in. There's not even a straight flush be out there. It's going to be sick for him, even if he has like the queen or king high flush when I jam, because I'm only repping the ace high flush. I basically, I have the ace of spades. It's like, what is my other card, though? Is it the ace of spades, or is it the another a non-spade? King, queen of spades, so sick. Oh, T. Clark just gets super coolered. Here we open, get super small three bet. We make it four dollars six cents to make it ten bucks. So I'm gonna call pretty much anything I open, even though we have a pretty trash hand. <laughs> Flop two pair. I'm uh, just gonna call because this puts up like one to one SPR going to the turn. Again, the super small three bet keeps me in. Flop two pair. Plays like ace king. We hold aces hold eighty one. Wow, that was lucky. <laughs> All right, so call against a super small three bet. Flop top two stack them. Interesting one here. We open flat flat. Just gonna get it in, so this player bets two, rips it in for 80. This player's not much deeper, so we'll get it in with the bottom set. Up against 9-5, we got 96%. And we do hold after some chop outs come on the turn. So they fold back to the button. See the call. Uh, 7 5, five go for bets. Uh, we do block one of the ace five suited. Oh boy, we're playing a big pot. <laughs> Alright, so raises, I'm just gonna call here. Uh, deuce turn, it's a good turn card. Oh, had the one remaining ace five, so sick when we're that deep. So here we get four bet, having queens under gun and hijack. We're just gonna flat, can do some jamming too. Eight, five, four, two diamonds. And I believe, okay, I went check two, we're in a bet. I was gonna say, I think this would be one that we jam against bets, but we'll just bet ourselves. Don't show me aces or kings. King, queen of diamonds, 53%. Nice. Safe, clean run out. Um, pretty deep here. This is like 170 bigs effective. We're just going to flat, flop top sets. Let's pair about three to one here. All right, so bet's just going to play as a call. 10 of the turn check. King, jack coming in. Let's bring that and then also some bad rivers. Obviously, I want to see a king or a jack along with clubs, but just going to call here, I think. That's 81. Ah, uh, do I check jam the turn or not? I think I just called and hope for no king, jack, or club. I don't know. It's a weird one. Eat river check. Keeps his bluffs in too. If he has king, jack, this is sick, but... Queen set over set. So nasty. Speaking of sick. All right, so open, get three bet. Mostly four betting here. So... It's an interesting flop. So we're going to start with quarter. So even though we flop top, top, kind of a scary board here. We're going to check most turns. Basically anything that's not a king, probably. Uh, deuce on the turn check. And then would really want to see hearts miss. And then as played on the river, I think go for block, or do we check here? I'm going to make a nitty check. This is maybe wrong. But setting the call here, even if they jam. Mostly be worried about like queen jack. Um, I think king queen king jack and about the turn most of the time small. Maybe if they have ace ten they get tricky, but not gonna fold here as played. Tens turns tens into bluff, so yeah, that's kind of hit we're hoping for. I do I actually like their bluff there. It's probably their best bluffing hand. So we're putting the cold four bet, limp raise three bets. We cold four, sizing up because we're deeper even against the bigger size here. Once we do this, it's to call us a lot of chips to get in pre for three hundred twenty five bucks, but. Kings would not be folding. Maybe could just click this to 60 because the bigger size, but I think I'm calling. Again, these ranges are probably pretty condensed, which makes this one kind of a weird flop because now we just have to always ace queen suited exactly, really. But I don't think we'd bet fold here. I have to worry about aces and queens, but kind of nasty with so much money in pre, but we'll bet here. Oh boy, I'm just going to get shown aces or queens, aren't I? Aces, all right. King of the turn, though. Oh my gosh, that's how good we're running today. Just complain about getting unlucky, and then you get there. Uh, open tens here. Get three bet. We call. Check the six five three. Uh, see the bigger bets. Going to be a call here. Six on the turn. Check. So we're a bit deeper as well. So I think less jamming with hands like tens. 
Uh, I'm trying to think if I want to jam this one. Having a club's kind of bad. I think we can still jam. This might be incorrect, but I'm gonna get, it's, you don't really get worse to call, but snap calls, aces. Yeah, I, we, we're maybe deep enough here. This jam with tens wasn't very good. Uh, here we face over bet with the six we'll call. And then if we get checked to, I'm probably going to bluff river trying to get worse. Actually, no, I, I'm going to bluff. I don't think he's going to bluff better ace high, so I guess I would just check here. So it's check, check, flop. We call over bet turn. And then if he bets river, it's kind of interesting to bluff with a six, honestly. So let's see. I check a lot here. I get six, five. This would be a pretty wild bluff. I guess you use it when I have a five or a six. Hard to find bluffs ever here. I think maybe you can get him full of the weaker set. All right, yeah, I'm going to bluff jam here with a six. Oh, please work. <laughs> this is a pretty wild pot. So check, check, flop, over bets, turn, over bets, river. I block him from the six, five. I can probably jam like Jackson tens here. We do get the folds. I think even if he has like fours, threes, or twos, it's just hard to find a bluff in my spot. I, th I think we have to try to hope he folds some of those sets.